Hello everyone, I hope you find yourself having a great day. I've got a quick down and dirty tutorial for you in Cinema 4D. We're going to create a leaf. Uh, I've got a nice leaf on my desktop here, even more leaves. Although we're not creating these, uh, let's get to it. It's going to be down and dirty like I said. I like to make them fast. So what we're going to do is we're going to drop a plane into our scene and scale it out to give somewhat the dimensions of the leaf we're going to be using. And the leaf that I'm using, I went outside with my uh, Canon uh, DSLR, took a picture of a uh, uh, hibiscus leaf. And this is what we got. I went into Photoshop and trimmed out all the background area. I had set it on the concrete and trimmed out all that. So all this black area that you see is going to be alpha channel. It's going to be transparent. So we'll get on out of there, back into Cinema 4D. We're going to create a texture. Double click down here. We're going to move into that texture and we're going to select, we're going to turn off specular, select the color channel, browse for that texture, and we'll select it. And we're going to go select, uh, check the highlight, um, put a check mark in alpha, go back to our color channel, where it says texture, just right click it, choose copy, go back to alpha, select it, the texture, right click, paste. That'll save us a little bit of browsing. I like it fast and it's a little bit of a cheat for you there. So we're going to take that texture we've created, drag on to our plane, and if you render it, you can see already we've got quite a nice leaf. Okay. So we're going to take it a little bit one step further is we're going to make this uh, have a little bit more of a contour, a little bit more depth. Although it's a plane, plane doesn't have much uh, thickness, so we're going to fake that. I'm going to select my plane, press C to make it editable. I'm going to grab my bend modifier, and I'm going to throw that into the scene. I'm going to drag that on top of the plane. Well, we've got our little down arrow. Now it's part of that. Okay. So we're going to select our plane. We're going to tell it to keep the Y axis length. Right. And we're going to adjust the strength so we can see what it's going to do. Okay. The direction it might fall. All right. So once we've got that, we can take a rotation tool and just simply put a little bit of a contour so we can go convex or concave. Give it a little bit more believability. Alright. Get a render of that real quick. One from the side. One from this side. You see how we're making it a little bit more believable already. You could take it one step further. I'm going to hide this bend modifier here. I'm going to drop a, another bend modifier in here. And with this one what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell it also to keep the y-axis. Um, I'm going to give it a little bit of strength except with this time what I'm going to do is I'm going to rotate that guy while it's outside of our plane. I'm going to rotate it um, 180 degrees here. See if that works for us. Drop that into our plane. Okay. And if we got that right, which we didn't, we need to go take it back out. And rotate that back again. Let's try this here. See what that looks like. That's gonna be need to come back in a little bit. Something about like that. Drop it back into our plane. And at this point, if we rotate it, we can get a little bit of a twist on that leaf so that it's uh, not perfectly flat with its concave or convex arch on it. Just gives it a little bit more believability. And um, that's it. I hope you liked it. I hope it's helpful for you and maybe it's something you can use in your future project. Uh, if you need this leaf, I think I'll go ahead and save this project out and uh, that way you'll have a copy of the texture. Uh, you might want to take your cell phone. Uh, quality of the pictures aren't necessarily uh, paramount, but um, if you'd like, uh, take your DSLR, get out there, get a few leaves, get a few different pictures, a few different types of uh, angles on the same type of leaf with a little bit of uh, flaws and defects and a little bit of uh, dry, different colored variety. So hope it helps. Remember, if you like my channel, please comment, rate, and subscribe. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.